Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. Today, I am sharing our June 2021 monthly grocery haul. It's the first one I've done in a long time because of having the baby. I did, I was always doing monthly hauls and then I went to doing like week by week because we were kind of waiting on the baby and then the baby came and then life was crazy and hectic. And so this is the first time I've tried since we've had our baby to do a one month haul. And I realized as I sat there looking at our meal plan that I had no idea what I was doing again. So I feel like this is a really good start, but I'm probably missing quite a bit. So um, this is for our family of eight, even though one of them doesn't eat yet. So it's really for a family of seven that eats, but we are a family of eight. So this includes hopefully as much food as possible for our family for breakfast, lunches, dinners through the month. We will have to go back for fresh fruits, fresh veggies, milk, stuff like that. And I'm sure some things that I missed because I tried my best and that's all that matters. But um, here we go. I'm going to show you what we got. And yes, there is a lot of, I like to make stuff from scratch. I really do. But right now is not the time for that because mama is still trying to get used to life with a baby. Even though this is number six, it's still like every time you have one, it's like a shock. It's like, how do you juggle what you just we're doing with your life every day without a baby and now you've got a baby to take care of and hold and do this and do that like 24 seven and it's a readjustment every time. So we're still in that phase. I'm still trying to like figure life out. So there's a lot of easy foods that my kids can make by themselves for right now and that's okay. Um, I just know in my last grocery haul, people were like, that's a lot of processed food. Well, yeah, right now it is and that's life and it's okay because we'll get back to the healthy stuff eventually and it all balances out. So here we go with our grocery haul. Um, if you have any questions, leave them down below. Don't forget to watch our June meal plan because it shows you what all this food is for. So there you go. All right, so here it is. Look at this. This is definitely the biggest haul I've done in a long time. But I think I'm gonna start over here. That way maybe I can pause and then come over here. That way we can get this frozen stuff put away. So I got two boxes of popsicles because summer. I got these, it's two boxes of the banquet ribs to do copycat McRibs again, cause those were so good. I got four packs of bacon for the month. We, I think we also have like one or two downstairs. I got a pack of pork chops because I wasn't sure if I had pork chops downstairs or not. So I went ahead and bought some and one big family pack of chicken breast, but I'll split that probably in two. Um, and then I got two little packs of chicken breast and we do have chicken in the freezer already. So I just bought some just in case. I don't know. I didn't buy any ground beef though because Gary says that we have a lot downstairs. I just can't find it. So he says that there is a lot down there. I got two packs or two um, things of country mild sausage, two of hot and one regular. And then I got some Vermont maple sausage links. We got maple flavored pork sausage patties. I got these for the kids to have pop in like an easy lunch for themselves. These, I got two pepperoni pizzas and two supreme thin crusts to go in the freezer. Um, I can make those for lunch or we can have them like as a quick, easy dinner one night if we need them or something. I got, I didn't know I got pork egg rolls. We usually always have the chicken, but I got two of each. So we'll try pork this time. But the Walmart ones are the best. We didn't like the name brand ones at all. The great value are amazing. Chicken nuggets for easy lunches. I got fries for a dinner, a couple garlic breads for a dinner, got ravioli for a dinner, two packs of chicken breasts for a dinner, two different dinners that I need, steakums for a dinner. I got these because <laughs> we got Rocky Road and Unicorn Sparkle ice creams. I got frozen blueberries because I wanted to make something. I can't remember what it was, but it called for frozen blueberries. Um, two packs of onion rings, that's for the same dinner, but we're going to need two bags just to, for everybody to eat them. And I got fish sticks to throw in the freezer for a quick, easy lunch. Or if we decide we want to end up having them for a quick, easy dinner one night and we need something so we can throw those in the freezer for now. Now to go on to this stuff, cause I got a kid dying to get into the cereal already. Let me see. We have dishwasher detergent. I don't really need any other household stuff. We have all of our like hygiene, our shower stuff. We have, we have toothpaste. We have um, everybody's body wash, shampoo, conditioner. Um, I have all of our laundry stuff. 
I, like, I don't think I needed any other cleaning stuff. We have paper towels and toilet paper. So we'll see if I need anything else, but I don't think that I really do. We got two of the white cranberry strawberry juices. Those are so good. I got a five pound, five pound bag of sugar, 10 pound bag of potatoes. I got oranges, cuties, apples. I got two of the twists. I actually ordered the Walmart Cherry Coke and they substituted, or Cherry Cola, and they substituted for actual name brand Coke. So we got two Cherry Cokes. These are extra, I'll show you in a minute. Yep, I got three sub rolls. We need those for three different dinners this month. I got two things on uh, bagels because we still have some, but everybody here likes to eat bagels. So I got a regular and an onion. Got four breads. I got three hamburger buns and one hot dog bun for this month um, for different meals. I got some mozzarella cheese for pizza nights, pepperoni for that as well. We got some of this ham. My kids like to eat this, but it's also to throw in, you know, or good to throw in whatever. I got two of the yogurt tubes. Let's see. Mozzarella cheese for a meal this month. We got honey ham and turkey breast lunch meat. I actually have um, roast beef and bologna in the freezer downstairs that I saw yesterday, so I didn't get anything else. We got Colby Jack, two of these. These are the same as getting, the same price as getting like a block. Um, so I just got these since they're already cut up. And I got the mild cheddar blocks too, or cubes I mean. Heavy whipping cream. I got two of the two packs of cream cheese, so that's four total. We got four um, cinnamon rolls because that's one day and that's one day, so it's only two days of cinnamon rolls. Crescent rolls for meals. Only needed two milks because we had quite a bit downstairs. I got a strawberry whipped cream cheese and a regular whipped cream cheese. Well, two of those. One is for that sausage crescent roll thing, and then one's for bagels. French onion dip, sour cream, butter ricotta cheese for a meal. And I thought I only ordered two of these whipped toppings and I ended up with four. There was something else I saw that I thought I ordered two of and I still, I ended up with four as well. So I can't, no, I ordered four bread. There was, I can't remember what else it was, but I guess I'll come across it soon. Um, I got co chocolate caramel coffee creamer for myself. I got two iced coffees for myself and I got my husband a French vanilla creamer. We got two bags of chips. We got the wavy ones for this French onion dip. I got some barbecue chips because everyone here likes them besides me, but I figure they'll get eaten really quickly. I got six key lime pie whips, six of the orange cream ones, and six strawberry. These are mine and Wilder's favorite. Wilder really, really likes these as well. I thought I was the only one, but he prefers these and wants to eat them all the time. The other day, I think he ate like two of them in one sitting. And then we also got regular yogurts. We got vanilla, strawberry, banana, and that one down there is key lime. I got a tomato, um, four kiwis, two limes, two lemons, some avocado, two green peppers. This will only last through the week. I'll have to get more fresh stuff next weekend. I got a bag of Caesar salad mix, some bananas, some baby spinach, two cucumbers, and two zucchinis. I need this for a meal. I got a watermelon, grapes, some peppers, pineapple, two strawberry um, containers, one blackberry and one blueberry. And we still have some fruits and veggies in the fridge. So that and that should be good for the week for everybody. We got mini marshmallows to do with some rice crispy or rice crisps, the great value kind back there to do rice crispy treats one day. I got some candy for a movie night. There's just a bunch of different random ones. These are like the 98 cent packs at Walmart. Um, a little, the little flour tortillas. And then I got three regular tortillas. Well, medium, I guess, size. Um, let's see, two packs of chocolate raisins. Hopefully that'll last a month. I got two packs of chocolate chip muffins, two strawberry cheesecake ones. Um, I plan on making a banana bread this month for a breakfast, but just in case we were out of bananas for some reason, I went ahead and got this just so I'd have like a backup option. I got a Caribbean jerk wing seasoning mix because we're gonna have Caribbean jerk chicken one day this month for a meal. I got au jus gravy for something, I can't remember, something this month. Some ranch packets. We got four um, of the Walmart brand shells and cheese. 
Everly asked me to get unicorn mac and cheese, so I got those. That's a good lunch for around here. And then I got four of the thick and creamy Walmart brand. Another good lunch or dinner or whatever. Lots of teenagers, lots of kids in the house that like mac and cheese. So we go through a lot of boxes if we make them. Let's see. I got three each of these boxes. So I got three bursting berry and three strawberry applesauce packs. I got one fudge brownie pack. This is another thing I thought. I thought I only got one yellow cake mix and somehow I ended up with two. Um, garlic season and butter flavored croutons. These are so good. Like I just like to snack on these. They are amazing. This is my favorite flavor. So I got two of those. I got a Caesar salad dressing. I got two of the chocolate syrups, two of the ranches. That's what's right there. I got two of each, but I was just running out of room. One thing of ketchup. I got um, Walmart brand, Raisin brand. I actually got Walmart brand of, I can't remember what they called these for in the Walmart name, but they were out and they substituted this, which is pretty cool. I, like I said, I got the Rice Krispie Treats. This Hayden's been dying to get into the fruit spin, so hang on. Hayden, here you go. I got two pie crusts. I don't really have any meat, uh, um, oh my gosh, desserts planned for this month, but I went ahead and grabbed these just in case I wanted to make something like with the whipped topping, like a no-bake pie or something. So I grabbed those. I got iced tea bags, some crackers to do homemade Lunchables this month. Let's see. Two more of the tropical fruit because my girls love this. Um, I got a strawberry pie filling, a lemon pie filling. I got this. I saw on Pinterest, I think the other day, a lemon cobbler. And I was like, mm, I think my husband would like that. So I got that. That was a specific dessert. This was not, but I like that strawberry pie filling. I got these on a whim too. I don't have any plans for those. Um, I need baked beans for tomorrow, actually. We got four things of sweet peas because I think I'm completely out of sweet peas downstairs. I got two um, cans of pizza sauce for pizza nights, days, whatever we do. Um, we like to do pizza stuff for lunch, like pizza bagels or just whatever. So I got some pizza sauce. Blueberry pie filling, again, no real plan for that, but my husband likes blueberry stuff. So if I want to make something, I wanted to have it downstairs. Um, one can of green beans. I got that for something, but I can't remember. I got pickles, some banana peppers, and two um, tomato, basil, garlic, pasta sauces. And I think that's it. But like I said, I have meat in the freezer. We've got um, a huge tub of rice downstairs. We've got pasta downstairs. Um, we've got quite a bit downstairs, but this is stuff that we also need to keep replenishing because like mac and cheese doesn't last long around here. Um, yogurt doesn't last long around here. Cereal doesn't either. We don't really do cereal much for breakfast. It's more of a snack around here for everybody. Um, but we go through that really quickly because if everyone has a bowl or two, the box is gone. So, um, but yeah, I think that's it. But I know that I'm going to be missing stuff and I'm going to have to go back for more. But this is a good starting point for trying to go back into monthly shopping. And all of the breads, anything that I don't need soon will go in the freezer. So we'll just pull it out. All I do is throw it in there, pull it out when it's done, and we never have a problem thawing them. That was it. Thank you guys for watching. Here's the total. I don't know if that's a lot or a little bit, but it's kind of what I'm striving for right now. And again, like I said, I know I'm going to have to do this. Oh, and we do have, I forgot to say this earlier. We do already have meat in the freezer. Um, I might say this through the hall. So my husband's actually at Walmart right now picking it up, but the baby's asleep and the kids are eating. So I have a quiet moment to film this part. Yeah, we have meat in the freezer. We have some canned veggies. We have some um, rice downstairs. We have frozen veggies, stuff like that. So this isn't like an entire month's worth of food for that price because we already have a lot of it already. So that was it. Thank you guys for watching. I will talk to you in the comments below. If you have any questions, ask them and I'll see you tomorrow with another new video. And don't forget to watch the day in the life videos where I show you how we make all this food. So thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and enjoy these other videos we have coming up for you. Also, you can turn on the red bell notifications so you're notified of every new video we post. Thank you so much.